My name is Scott Balson and I'm the co-founder and co-owner of the Electric Bicycle Stores located in Fort Lauderdale and in Miami Beach. Well, currently we're in Fort Lauderdale, as you can see, it's a gorgeous day out today and we just got uh, through test riding one of these gorgeous electric bicycles made by Hero. It's an A to B. Uh, they make a number of different bikes in the line. This is a soft tail suspension, so for comfort it does actually have some give and uh, that's very nice for a longer ride for uh, comfort. And we rent these bicycles for a full day for $79 and we rent them for a half day for $49. Uh, or $59 depending. Uh, we have a number of different um, features to this particular bike. You've got seven gears for pedaling if you wish to pedal it as a pedal bike. You also have a throttle and I can demonstrate that for you right here. If I just twist the throttle you'll notice that the back wheel will go instantly 20 miles an hour. Again. And that 20 miles an hour will take you approximately 20 to 25 miles at about 85% throttle. The key goes from the, you can put it into the A position and you're given a, essentially like a car, your F and your E for your uh, fuel gauge. You're also given a miles per hour indicator, which can be changed to kilometers if you wish. And you'll notice that underneath it, it says battery A because then you're in the A battery. It also has a trip set and an odometer set like a car. So you can set those back to zero anytime you want to. This is your throttle. As you notice, I'm going faster or slower with the throttle. It comes with an onboard computer so that you can see your speed. And if you want, it also comes with an extra battery that would be placed onto the back of the bike, which would double your range so that it's called an A, it's called an A to B because you go from the A battery to the B battery. Uh, these bikes sell for between $2,900 and $3,400 depending upon the specs. They're a German design, they are a patented design, they're a German motor and frame as well. They're currently uh, owned by Hero Eco uh, and will be manufactured, I believe, starting next year in Germany once again, so that's great. They're uh, essentially hand tick welded and there's just a beautiful, uh, you know, uh, artistry to, to how these bikes are manufactured been their number one dealer for five years. We're very proud of that. And they've been our practically our best seller the whole time that we've been a store. When this company first got started, they actually used the tagline to replace the car for the short commute. And it actually does that. Uh, we, when we rent it, we outfit it with this bag in front so that you can put your sunglasses and your wallet and your keys and such. It does have an optional back rack so that you can put saddle bags, hard case, laptop, uh, pannier bag, or pannier to speak French. Um, it also has the ability to not only have saddlebags on either side, but that extra battery underneath the middle and a basket up on top. So really you can tote, you can go shopping, you can take the things you need to take or go to the beach, put a towel in the back. A tremendous, you know, uh, saver of, of money when, you're when, you, when you discuss, for instance, what you're going to save on gas. To go essentially 20 miles might cost you about five cents worth of electricity. Um, so that's nice. It's, it's wonderful for a commuter. It's got a lot of strength in the motor. They use them in San Francisco to get up the hills. So we certainly have uh, no challenges for the bike here in, in very flat Florida. Uh, it's made of T6 aircraft aluminum, so it's going to weather very well. Now, if it's completely empty, it takes about four hours to recharge the battery, which is not terrible considering how large a battery it is. The battery has no memory. It works just like your cell phone or your laptop, so there's none of that, you know, having to charge it all the way up and drain it all the way down. What is most uh, attractive about this bike, other than the fact that it is uh, clearly attractive, is that, and this is what I tell the people that, are, that buy this bike, they're prim primarily, I would say, um, people who are my age, and um, so you'll notice down here, for instance, it's a low step-in, but it doesn't appear feminine. So it appeals to men who necessarily are not able or are interested in throwing their leg over a very high bar. Uh, the big wide tires uh, conceal the fact that there's a much bigger inner tube, which means that you're actually riding on a bigger bladder of air, which gives you a, a softer ride. Like they talk about the you know, the, sh the wolf in sheep's clothing, this is more of a sheep in wolf's clothing. Uh, under uh, federal law, and, and practically most state laws, this is a bicycle under the law. It requires no licensure, no uh, 
uh, license plate, registration, insurance, gas, or sweat. You can find more about us at, online at www.theelectricbicyclestore.com. We're located in Fort Lauderdale. You feel free to give us a call if you want at 954-565-0562. You can test ride anything in our store.